the Broken Teddy Bear presents I have a 360 under flip with Mark Hansen and Tim Hortons. Foot position in. You got your feet like a shove it. That's pretty much it. That's the prerequisite of this trick. Know how to shove it. Alright, how are we gonna do a 360 under flip, you ask? Good question. Ugh. So, already told you, foot position is just like a shove it. That's kind of the first step. It's just popping a shove it. Second step, during the shove it, your back foot's hanging out in the back here, and right at this point, it's gonna clip the bottom of the board right there, like a bit more to this side, and you flick it up. And then the board, because it's already doing a shove it, gets that flick going, and stays in the air longer, and then you get the whole 360 on your flip. It's pretty, it's a pretty subtle motion, but it's pretty easy to get once you get the general feel of how your feet are supposed to be moving. So yeah, first pop the shove it, second flick your foot up, third since you just flicked your foot up your back foot's going to be over top of it anyways pretty much and you're going to have such an easy time landing that once you've actually got the flick down because your board's just going to come and hit your foot and like it stops for you. It's a really easy trick to master but like a hard trick to get at the beginning. You'll probably mess up your three flips when you learn these, but practice them both and you'll get it good. There's no real problem in doing these other than just not doing the flick right, so yeah. Yeah, 360 under flips. Not that complicated a trick, just practice and make yourself flick it right. Gamer! One more thing you can do with these is shove it under flips. No 360 part. Same motion, just gotta flick a little different. 